everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Jordan if you are new here and today is Monday so it's Monday January 31st 2022 and it's the first Monday that I'm home from my contract on board Adventure of the Seas so my first Monday home in over nine months almost ten months I wanted to bring you along for the day show you how I'm getting back into the routine of being home and kind of getting back into a flow things have been quite crazy the last few days just because I've been going non-stop trying to fit everything in in the short period that I am home since I work on a cruise ship I have resigned for another contract in a month from now so I am leaving the end of February and so that means I have a very brief time at home and since it's been so long since I was home I really want to make the most of my time and just do all the things that I was missing out on so it's going to be a very productive day don't know exactly what my plans are for the entire day but you guys are gonna come along for the ride and the first order of business is a workout. So I woke up around quarter to eight. It is now like 8.30ish. So I am going to just do a little at home workout and continue on with my morning. For my workout today, I am just wearing my new favorite set from Paragon Fitwear. So I have this little muscle tee. It's like a cropped muscle tee and it's just black. Usually I hate this style on me, but for some reason I feel like it's very flattering at the moment. At least this top, I'm obsessed. And then I paired it with their black leggings, which are so amazing. They're so, so buttery soft and they're very form-fitting, so they're super flattering. They suck everything in and they're honestly the perfect length for me because I'm 5'1 and they are full length. So this is my outfit for my workout. J Balth for 10% off your order if you do decide to shop, but it's not sponsored. And let's get into the workout. great workout I did some Lily Sabri videos it is so nice to have internet access fast internet access to do these workout videos so I did like three or four videos and took a shower so now I need to start a load of laundry and I'm going to make myself some breakfast because I am hungry and then of course it's coffee time but that goes without saying also, I just did my nails last night, this hot pink color with my new gel set. So I got a lamp and a whole pack of different gel colors from Amazon and it actually turned out so nice. I'm obsessed. Hi, Coco Bean. Hi, Coco Bean. How are you doing, baby? You got some crusties in your eyes. 
This toast, like, toast doesn't fit in the toaster. Time to whip out the good stuff. Oh yeah. It is time to make my iced coffee with my Mr. Coffee iced coffee maker. I love this thing. It was like $30. This is the coffee I'm going to be using. I've never had it, but it's white chocolate flavored. Susie got it for me. Did you get this from TJ Maxx? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just a dash of creamer. Oop. It's fine. Give her a little shake. Cheers. My load of laundry is done, so I just have to transfer it to the dryer. It is so nice to have my own washer and dryer again. plan out my day I need to make a list of everything I want to accomplish if you've been here you know how much I love to do lists love checking things off and I love being productive I am the most type a person you'll probably ever meet so I'm gonna make my to-do list for the day there's a lot I want to get done that's the plan ladies and gents so I have quite a bit to get done today as you can see I went shopping yesterday with my mom and have yet to put everything away I'll show you what I got later though but for now we're just we're leaving it here I have just quickly changed my outfit because I am going out so I just have a plain white little turtleneck with my Princess Polly jeans and I have this adorable bag from Sinbono. It is the cutest green color. It is absolutely perfect for spring and it is genuine leather so it is amazing quality and I'm just obsessed with the style. The little, the strap is so cute and just all around obsessed. So I do have a discount code if you guys are interested but I'm in love with this bag. It's my new fave and I thought just a basic outfit would give this all the attention. It is like the perfect pop of color and I just love it. I am ready to go. We're gonna run some errands. I'm in the car with my mom. We're actually gonna go pick up my grandma's car. She's letting us borrow it so that I have a car while I'm home since I don't have my lease anymore. And then I have to go to the tailors and the post office. So that's the plan. Mom is here. Driving. Hi, this is me. <laughs> Without my face covering. I get my hands looked at today and I'll be a brand new person. Because I really think I'm only like 50 years old. <laughs> and I said to your mother, how can I be 50 and you be 60? That's impossible. I'm glad Jordan is home. <laughs> I wish you could stay here forever. But there goes her career. So I'll let her have her career. You only live once. And I wish I was going to Europe with her. Oh, I she love, was grandma. love Europe. Grandma was a world traveler herself. I was. Three times I went to Europe. My favorite country is Italy. I love Italy especially the Amalfi Coast. 
My favorite city, however, is Paris. I will always love Paris. It is the most wonderful, wonderful city. And young people don't appreciate it. It's not till they get older, and you should go at least twice to Paris. It's the first time you cannot see everything. Yeah. So take my advice. You heard it here first. <laughs> signing off for the head, head person in the Valth Randall family. <laughs> Grandma Coon, everyone. Bye-bye. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Oh, I'm so glad you're home, baby. I want to see you again before you go. My God, I miss you so much. I know. I'll hopefully see you Wednesday. Next stop, the tailors. I have a bag of pants here that are quite long on me, of course. So I'm gonna bring these in and get them hemmed. Hi, baby. Hello. Did you just wake up from a nap? Hi, sweetie pie. We're home! I had a very eventful last couple hours. I got my pants tailored. I dropped off the envelope for Brian. I went to Aldi and I got some egg whites because we didn't have any. And now I'm starving, so I'm going to make some lunch. But I'm not like a lunch gal. I like breakfast food for lunch, so I'll probably make like a parfait or something. I'm having a wonderful day. I feel so happy. I made these little energy balls last night and they are to die for. I made a reel with the ingredients, so if you want to check it out, it's on my Instagram, but I'm going to have one of these while I'm preparing my lunch because I am starving. So I just made a yogurt parfait with blueberries, raspberries, and vanilla granola, and then I have some everything bagel pretzel crisps and some garlic hummus. I've sat down with my laptop. I have a lot of comments to reply to. I have been slacking the last few days just because I've been so busy, and I also need to proofread or proof watch, I'm sorry, my sign up vlog. It is completely edited, so I need to just Proof watch it, make sure everything looks good, and export it so that it is ready to upload. So I'm going to do some computer work for now, and it is 3.15. hour or so responding to comments on my videos and I'm still not caught up and honestly reading the comments makes me so grateful for each and every one of you and I try to say this as much as I can in my videos but I really just wanted to sit down and thank you guys for investing your time into my videos the amount of time you've spent watching my videos and following along with my life what I'm up to and my journey is just unbelievable and the internet is so crazy like I know I put my life out on YouTube to share but for so many of you to actually care about me and my well-being is just amazing and I am truly 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 grateful and humbled and honored and appreciative I really hope that I can meet more of you on my upcoming contracts. I, I like, I'm literally speechless. I'm just so grateful and appreciate everyone for being so genuine and following my life and watching my videos. So that's that. I will try to get to more comments later, but I wanted to show you what I got from my shopping trip yesterday because I will be putting it all away and... I just felt like it was easier to show you before it goes in my closet. So, to be honest, I'm way too lazy right now to try anything on, so I'm just going to show you it by holding it up. So, the first thing I got was from Zara. I got this beautiful 
blue wrap dress. It is like a silk material. It's long sleeve and it just ties around in the front. They're so easy to throw on and style. So very excited about that. And I actually don't have anything in that color. Also from Zara, I got this little cropped gray hoodie. A solid basic. This was on clearance for $8. And I did also pick up one pair of jeans from Zara. So these are just like a straight leg medium wash jean. They are high waisted and they are way too long for me, like a solid seven inches too long, but I'm just going to cut them with scissors and I'll have like a frayed hem, which is super cute. Aerie was having a sale, so I did pick up two bralettes. So the first bralette I got was just this hot pink one. It isn't lined and it doesn't have like padding or anything and i did also get this olive green one so this one is like a halter style and it is lace as well but this one has padding i did get another pair of jeans from american eagle but these were 9.99 so i just got these skinny jeans from american eagle they do have some slight rips but there is like jean material underneath it so i don't have any like exposed skin and i found the most comfy little sweatpants joggers from American Eagle. These were on sale for $7 and they're like a cream color. I wish you could feel these through the camera because oh my god they feel like that barefoot dreams. I think that's what it's called. Barefoot dreams? Robe? Blanket thing? I don't know. It was very trendy but oh my god. I did go to the Nike outlet. The entire store was on sale, so I did pick up a few things because I love Nike and the quality is just amazing. So first thing I got was just this gray sports bra. I've been trying to get more basics in my closet and get rid of some of the older ones. So I got this just gray basic long sleeve. It just has the small Nike symbol in the corner or like in the, in the chest area. And I did also get another little cropped crew neck sweatshirt. So this is this beautiful peachy coral color. These sleeves just say Nike Pro on them. And this was on sale for $24.99. I found some really good deals. So I went to Express, the outlet store, and I found this stunning sparkly dress. It was originally $150 and I got it on clearance for $25 or $27, but I thought this would be absolutely perfect for New Year's or any other special occasion And it fits me like a glove like it was meant for me I did pick up one sweater because it is currently winter out and for my next contract It will be a little chillier. It'll be on the the cooler side. So I got this sweater It's so incredibly soft, but it's not that fuzzy material that will make you itchy or that will shed so it's adorable. Then when I was in the checkout lane, of course, they got me with those accessories. So I got this little pleather headband. It's just black and this was on clearance for $7. And I did also pick up this brown beanie. It's just a very thin waffle knit, but I don't have a hat in this color. So I thought this would be nice to bring with me on my contract if it is super cold. And the final place that I went was Banana Republic. And I don't usually shop here, but my mom wanted to stop in. And I'm glad we did because I found two really nice basics. So I just got this like ballet neck bodysuit. It is ribbed and it is like a three quarter length. So I found this for $5 and I got the same exact bodysuit also in a brown because brown of course is very trendy and we love a neutral color so I can do a lot with these. Again, I'm trying to build up my basics. I'm trying to become more minimalistic. I know you guys will probably laugh at me when I say that because I have so many clothes and a tough time letting them go but this is the first step. So that's everything I got on my shopping excursion. Oh, look at that. That's a perfect avocado.
I finished my plate. Hey, Dad. <laughs> Coco's out. It is time for bed now. I am quite tired and I just want to get a really good night of rest because I want to try and wake up early tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me for the day, kind of getting back on track, sort of in a routine, but again, I'm only home for a very short period of time, so I'm just trying to stay as organized as possible because pretty soon I'm going to have to start packing again for my next contract. I am also going to New York City with my mom to visit my brother, so may or may not be vlogging that trip. But yeah, thank you again so much for watching. I love you all to the moon and back, seriously, from the bottom of my heart. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.